Hey everyone, thanks for stopping by and welcome to my video review of the Echo One AK Drum Mag. I got this magazine off Airsoft GI for $65, though if you're looking to save some money, you can buy the Matrix version off of Evic, which is basically the same thing for about $10 less. I've noticed a discrepancy in the advertising for this product throughout the years, where it'll switch between 2,500 and 3,000 rounds. It's honestly more towards the 3,000 round range. The build quality of the magazine is pretty sturdy, as the body and most of the metal bits are made of steel. The lip on the front of the magazine that attaches to the inside of the front of the AK Magwell and the part that catches onto the magazine release are both made out of casted metal. Both of these parts, however, are extremely sturdy as I've owned one of these magazines for about 8 years. Loading the magazine simply begins with removing the nut and metal plate on the rear side. Before filling the magazine with BBs, be sure to move the plastic plate that keeps the BBs in the reservoir to the bottom position. This will allow you to increase the capacity of the magazine to the max. The magazine is powered by two AA batteries which are not included. Use a small Phillips head screwdriver to install or replace your batteries. Make sure to turn on your magazine by flipping the small on-off switch located on the battery box. The magazine is operated by a high cap winding mechanism attached to a small motor. Then, replace the metal plate and secure the nut. Finally, make sure to depress the little plastic piece that's now present on the front of the magazine. This will allow your entire reservoir of BBs to feed into the magazine. The fitment for this magazine is excellent and it'll fit in almost any AK on the market today. CYMA, both VFC and TM spec, Echo One, D-Boys, Double Bell, VFC and LCT. Haven't tested it on any NL, so I'm not sure if that'll fit. The highest rate of fire I've been able to test this magazine with is about 30 rounds per second, and it kept up with that gun pretty well. I haven't tested it myself with any faster shooting guns, though I've seen it work with other people's builds. I'll leave a link in the description for both Evic and Airsoft GI where you can buy both the Echo One version as well as the Matrix version of this magazine. Thanks for watching. I've noticed a discrepancy between the capacity. The capacit capacitability? <laughs> That's what I was gonna say! <laughs>